Sunday afternoon, I joined about 100,000 other people. We walked across the Edmund Pettus Bridge in Selma. Fifty years after Bloody Sunday, we reclaimed that bridge for the work of justice going forward. We crossed it just like Martin Luther King did, with people of every stripe, every size, every belief system, and we were jostling and we were moving through, and everybody was patient, and everybody was kind, because we were there for a purpose bigger than ourselves. Now, we know the work of Dr. Martin Luther King. We know the work of all the people who came when he called and said help. But maybe we didn't remember that two of the people that helped train him helped him learn how to organize from right here in Florida. Harry T. and Harriet V. Moore. Before there was Selma in 1965, there was Harriet and Harry in 1951. Oh, Harriet. Harriet married Harry T. First to work in Florida for the NAACP. By day they taught elementary school. By night they knocked on doors, registering the African vote and teaching folks what votes for. Harriet. Turns out the school board didn't like their politics. So Harriet went to teaching in Mims, one room school, reading, writing, arithmetic, equal rights, and the golden Harriet. Oh, Harriet did everything right by Harry's side. Tireless and tested until the day they died. She walked the walk and talked the talk of all that she believed. Fighting for justice in the land Lunches made from food from her own home. She'd wash their face and braid their hair and teach them to be proud. She taught them they were beautiful and strong inside and out. Harriet. Oh, Harriet did everything right by Harry's side. Tireless and tested until the day they died. She walked the walk and talked the talk of all that she believed. Fighting for justice in the land. to bed, laid down next to Harry, 25 years since they were wed, but someone had placed dynamite beneath their bedroom floor to try to stop the justice that they were working for. Harriet. Oh, Harriet did everything right by Harry's side, tireless and tested until the day they died. She walked the walk and talked the talk of all that she believed, fighting for justice in the land of liberty. Harriet and Harry T. Florida's first martyrs for the cause of equal rights as level ground as God's and nature's law. Now, in 
Selma. Nobody could stay with the group they came with because we braided in and out of each other. We weaved and we mingled and we moved and we sang together. Song after song after song, we sang. Okay. 